All of the new changes that are planned for Butler really are exciting to all of us at Butler students and staff as well as fellows. Butler's a great place to be. The students absolutely love it here. According to the university architect, the new rooms in Butler will be some of the biggest and most spacious among the residential colleges. Basically, they'll be the hot commodity on campus. Rooms won't just be isolated rooms like they were before, but they'll have lounge areas and places to hang out and to relax, as opposed to just having hallways with rooms in them. There's a cafe being built there. Butler will now be a kind of center down campus that will attract not just Butler students, but probably students from a lot of colleges. One of the objectives for the project has been trying to connect the southern end of the campus more into the undergraduate heart of Princeton. And Butler really does do that. Uh, it's an area where a number of students live. It's where student athletes spend a significant amount of their time. It's close to the sciences and the lab buildings. So we wanted to find a way of creating a, an undergraduate student hub. The new Butler will include some great outdoor space, including a park-like space where students will read and relax and meet up with each other and you'll know, have a shared space of community. We're actually looking forward to being the greenest college among the residential colleges and also a place where this is being looked at from an academic standpoint. So we're very excited about the possibility um, that this may be something which carries through to other buildings as well and help kind of change the consciousness about sustainability and architecture on campus. One of the unique parts of this project is the architecture. Harry Cobb, the architect, tried to find a way of creating buildings that are really in a modern vocabulary, but use many of the same features that a collegiate Gothic dorm would have. Almost everyone I've spoken to in Butler is really excited about New Butler, and so I think the majority of the people I know are going to try to drop back into the four-year college system. One thing that makes Princeton's residential college system stand out is it really fosters a community within a community, and in a very broad sense on the academic side, on the social side, on the cultural side, civic engagement, all across the board. Any student that has gone through Princeton recognizes what a wonderful place it is and how much it has to offer and I think to continue that is the greatest gift one could give back. I think Butler will have an extraordinary impact both physically as well as on community building. It completes a part of the campus. It not only marks the opening of our third four-year residential college, but it also creates another major gathering place for student undergraduate life uh, that we felt the campus really needed.